7 Powerful Functions of MOSFETs in Electronics Metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistors MOSFETs, are crucial components in electronics, providing various functions that contribute to the functionality and efficiency of electronic circuits. Here are 7 powerful functions of MOSFETs in electronics. The switching function of MOSFETs is one of their primary and most fundamental roles in electronics. Here's an overview of how MOSFETs function as switches. On state, conduction. When a voltage is applied to the gate terminal of a MOSFET, an electric field is created, attracting charge carriers, electrons or holes, to form a conductive channel between the source and drain terminals. In the on state, the MOSFET acts as a low resistance channel, allowing current to flow between the source and drain terminals. This state is often referred to as saturation in MOSFET terminology. Off state, non conduction. Conversely, when no voltage is applied to the gate or the applied voltage is below a certain threshold, the electric field is insufficient to create a conductive channel. In this off state, the MOSFET acts as an open circuit, preventing the flow of current between the source and drain terminals. This off state is often referred to as the cutoff region in MOSFET operation. Rapid switching MOSFETs can transition between the on state and off state very quickly, making them suitable for high speed switching applications. This property is crucial in digital circuits, such as those found in microprocessors and memory devices where rapid transitions between logic states are required for efficient data processing. Digital Logic Applications MOSFETs are the key components in the design of digital logic gates, such as AND, OR, and NOT gates. The ability to switch rapidly between on and off states allows MOSFETs to perform logical operations, forming the basis of digital computing. Power Switching MOSFETs are widely used in power electronics for switching high voltages and currents in applications like power supplies, motor drives, and inverters. Their ability to handle high power levels while efficiently transitioning between on and off states is essential for power management. Energy Efficiency The low on resistance of MOSFETs during the on state contributes to energy efficiency in electronic circuits. This is particularly important in applications where minimizing power losses and heat dissipation is critical. In summary, MOSFETs are highly effective as electronic switches, offering fast switching speeds, low on resistance, and precise control over the flow of electrical current. These characteristics make them indispensable in a wide range of electronic applications, from digital logic circuits to power management systems. MOSFETs can be used for signal amplification in analog circuits, although their primary use is often associated with switching applications. Here's an overview of how MOSFETs can serve as amplifiers. Operating Region In amplification applications, MOSFETs are typically operated in the saturation region. In this region, the MOSFET allows a relatively constant and higher current to flow between the source and drain terminals for a certain range of input voltages. Small Signal Amplification MOSFETs can amplify small input signals by controlling a larger output current. The small input signal is applied to the gate, and the resulting variations in the electric field cause corresponding changes in the channel conductivity, resulting in an amplified output signal. Transconductance, GM The transconductance, GM, of a MOSFET is a key parameter in its amplification capability. It represents the change in output current with respect to a change in input voltage. Higher transconductance values generally indicate better amplification performance. Voltage gain MOSFETs can provide voltage gain in amplification circuits. The voltage gain, AV, is the ratio of the change in output voltage to the change in input voltage. Proper biasing and operating point selection are crucial for achieving desired voltage gain characteristics. Common Source Configuration The common source configuration is a common arrangement for MOSFET amplifiers. In this configuration, the input signal is applied to the gate terminal, and the amplified output is taken from the drain terminal. The source is usually grounded. Load resistance. A load resistor is often connected to the drain terminal to develop the amplified output voltage. 
The choice of the load resistor affects the gain and overall performance of the amplifier circuit. Frequency response. MOSFET amplifiers exhibit good frequency response, making them suitable for various applications, including audio amplifiers and radio frequency circuits. Class A amplification. MOSFETs can be operated in Class A mode, where they conduct throughout the entire input cycle. This configuration provides low distortion but is less power efficient compared to other amplifier classes. It's important to note that while MOSFETs can be used for amplification, other types of transistors like bipolar junction transistors, BJTs, are also commonly used for amplification purposes. The choice between MOSFETs and other amplification devices depends on the specific requirements of the application and the characteristics of the devices involved. MOSFETs play a significant role in voltage regulation within electronic circuits. Here's an overview of how MOSFETs contribute to voltage regulation. Voltage Regulator Basics Voltage regulation is the process of maintaining a stable output voltage despite variations in the input voltage or load conditions. Voltage regulators are used to achieve this stability. Linear Voltage Regulators MOSFETs are often integrated into linear voltage regulators. In a linear regulator, a MOSFET is used as a variable resistor to control the output voltage. The MOSFET adjusts its resistance to regulate the voltage across the load. Series Pass Element In linear voltage regulators, the MOSFET is typically used as a series pass element. The MOSFET is connected in series with the load, and its gate voltage is adjusted to maintain a constant output voltage. Feedback Control Voltage regulators often use feedback mechanisms to continuously monitor the output voltage and adjust the MOSFET's operation accordingly. This feedback loop helps compensate for variations in input voltage and changes in the load. Low Dropout Regulators, LDOs MOSFETs are commonly employed in low dropout regulators, LDOs, which are a type of linear voltage regulator that can maintain a stable output voltage even when the input voltage is very close to the output voltage. This is particularly useful in battery-powered devices. Switching Voltage Regulators MOSFETs are also crucial in switching voltage regulators. In these regulators, the MOSFET is used to switch the input voltage on and off rapidly. An inductor and capacitor are then used to filter and regulate the output voltage. Switching regulators are generally more power efficient than linear regulators. Efficiency and heat dissipation. Linear regulators with MOSFETs as series pass elements can dissipate significant power as heat, especially when there is a large difference between the input and output voltages. Switching regulators, on the other hand, are more efficient and generate less heat. Current Limiting and Protection MOSFETs in voltage regulators often have built-in features like current limiting and over-temperature protection to ensure the stability and reliability of the regulator in different operating conditions. In summary, MOSFETs are integral to voltage regulation in electronic circuits, providing a means to control and stabilize the output voltage. Whether used in linear regulators or switching regulators, MOSFETs contribute to the efficiency, precision, and reliability of voltage regulation in a wide range of applications. Signal modulation is a key function in communication systems, allowing the transmission of information over a carrier signal. While MOSFETs are not the primary components for modulation, they play a role in the modulation process, especially in the context of amplification and signal processing. Here's how MOSFETs are involved in signal modulation. Amplification for modulation. MOSFETs are often used in the amplification stages of electronic circuits that precede modulation. Before a signal is modulated onto a carrier wave, it is typically amplified to ensure that the modulated signal has sufficient strength for transmission. Mixer circuits. MOSFETs can be part of mixer circuits that combine the input signal with a carrier signal. Mixers generate some and different frequencies, facilitating frequency modulation, FM, or amplitude modulation, AM, in communication systems. Frequency modulation, FM. In FM modulation, 
The frequency of the carrier signal is varied based on the amplitude of the modulating signal. MOSFETs can be used in the generation and processing of signals in FM transmitters and receivers. Amplitude Modulation AM. In AM modulation, the amplitude of the carrier signal is varied according to the amplitude of the modulating signal. MOSFETs may be involved in the amplification stages of AM transmitters and receivers. Oscillators MOSFETs can be employed in oscillator circuits, which generate the carrier frequency in modulation systems. Oscillators play a crucial role in frequency synthesis for modulation applications. Phase-locked loops, PLLs MOSFETs are used in PLLs, which are essential for maintaining precise synchronization and stability in frequency modulation systems. PLLs ensure that the modulating and carrier signals are accurately aligned. Demodulation While MOSFETs are not as commonly associated with demodulation, they can be part of circuits involved in signal processing and demodulation. Demodulation is the process of extracting the original information signal from the modulated carrier. Variable Gain Control MOSFETs in variable gain amplifier circuits can be used to dynamically adjust the amplification of the modulating signal, providing flexibility in the modulation process. It's important to note that while MOSFETs may be present in various stages of modulation systems, other components like diodes, operational amplifiers, and specialized modulation circuits are also crucial for proper modulation and demodulation processes. The specific role of MOSFETs in a modulation system depends on the modulation scheme and the overall design of the communication system. MOSFETs are crucial components in power electronics, playing a key role in power conversion processes. Power conversion involves changing the characteristics of electrical power, such as voltage, current, or frequency, to meet the requirements of specific applications. Here's how MOSFETs contribute to power conversion. DC-DC converters. MOSFETs are commonly used in DC-DC converters, which convert one DC voltage level to another. These converters are prevalent in power supplies for electronic devices, helping regulate voltage levels efficiently. Switched Mode Power Supplies, SMPS MOSFETs are integral to SMPS, which are widely used in various electronic devices, including computers and LED drivers. SMPS efficiently regulate and convert electrical power by rapidly switching the MOSFETs on and off. Inverters Inverters convert DC power into AC power. MOSFETs are often used in the switching circuitry of inverters, allowing them to produce a high-quality AC output for applications such as motor drives, renewable energy systems, and uninterruptible power supplies, UPS. Motor drives. MOSFETs play a crucial role in variable frequency drives, VFDs, and other motor control systems. They are used to modulate the voltage and frequency supplied to electric motors, enabling precise control over motor speed and torque. Voltage Source Inverters, VSI MOSFETs are employed in VSIs, which are inverters that maintain a constant voltage output despite variations in load conditions. VSIs are commonly used in grid-tight inverters for renewable energy systems. Power Factor Correction, PFC MOSFETs are utilized in PFC circuits to improve the power factor of electrical systems. PFC helps optimize the use of electrical power in devices and systems, reducing energy losses and improving efficiency. Battery Charging MOSFETs are used in battery charging circuits, where they control the charging process by regulating the current and voltage applied to the battery. This is essential in applications such as electric vehicles and portable electronic devices. Resonant Converters Resonant converters, which use resonant circuits to achieve efficient power conversion, often incorporate MOSFETs. These converters are employed in high-frequency applications to reduce switching losses. Power Amplifiers MOSFETs are utilized in power amplifiers that increase the power level of signals in audio, radio frequency, and microwave applications. This is particularly important in communication systems and high-power audio amplification. Energy Harvesting 
MOSFETs can be part of circuits used in energy harvesting systems, where they help convert and manage energy from ambient sources such as solar, thermal, or vibration into usable electrical power. In summary, MOSFETs are versatile components in power electronics, enabling efficient and controlled power conversion in a wide range of applications, from consumer electronics to industrial power systems. Their ability to switch rapidly and handle high power levels makes them indispensable in modern electronic devices and systems. MOSFETs are known for their low power consumption characteristics, particularly in the off-state, making them suitable for various applications where energy efficiency is a priority. Here's how MOSFETs contribute to low power consumption. High Input Impedance MOSFETs have a high input impedance, which means they draw minimal current from the input signal source. This property reduces the power consumed by the MOSFET during signal processing, making them suitable for low-power applications. CMOS Technology Complementary Metal Oxide Semiconductor CMOS, technology, which utilizes both N-type and P-type MOSFETs, is widely used in digital integrated circuits. CMOS circuits have low static power consumption because, in the steady state, there is no direct current path between the power supply and ground. Zero standby power. MOSFETs in the off state have very low leakage currents. This characteristic is essential in applications where devices spend a significant amount of time in standby mode, ensuring that minimal power is consumed when the device is not actively performing a task. Power gating. MOSFETs are employed in power gating techniques, where sections of a circuit are selectively turned off when not in use. This approach reduces power consumption by cutting off the power supply to inactive parts of the circuit. Dynamic Voltage and Frequency Scaling DVFS. MOSFETs are used in circuits that implement DVFS, a technique where the operating voltage and frequency of a device are dynamically adjusted based on the workload. This helps optimize power consumption without sacrificing performance when full processing power is not required. Low on resistance. MOSFETs, especially those designed for low power applications, often have low on resistance in the conducting state. This characteristic minimizes power losses due to resistive heating when the MOSFET is in the on state. Efficient switching. MOSFETs can switch between on and off states rapidly reducing the time during which they are actively consuming power. This is crucial in digital circuits, where power consumption is directly related to the frequency of switching. Energy Harvesting MOSFETs are used in energy harvesting systems, where they efficiently manage and regulate the power generated from ambient sources. This is important in applications where power availability is intermittent, such as in sensor nodes or remote devices. Low Threshold Voltage Devices MOSFETs designed with low threshold voltages are often employed in low-power applications. Lower threshold voltages enable the MOSFET to turn on with smaller control voltages, reducing power consumption in the activation process. In summary, the low power consumption characteristics of MOSFETs, especially in their off-state and when implemented in CMOS technology, make them well-suited for applications that prioritize energy efficiency. These applications span a wide range, including portable electronic devices, battery-operated systems, and energy-conscious IoT devices. MOSFETs are fundamental components in the design and implementation of digital logic gates, forming the building blocks of digital circuits. Digital logic gates are the elementary building blocks of digital systems, processing binary information, zeros and ones. MOSFETs are particularly well-suited for this role due to their ability to act as electronic switches. Here's how MOSFETs contribute to digital logic gates. CMOS Technology Complementary Metal Oxide Semiconductor CMOS, technology is a widely used digital logic technology that incorporates both N-type and P-type MOSFETs. CMOS provides a good balance between low power consumption and high noise margins, making it popular in digital integrated circuits. Inverter, not gate. An inverter is the simplest digital logic gate, and it is often constructed using a single MOSFET. When the input to the MOSFET is high, the output is low, and vice versa. This inversion of the input signal characterizes the not gate. End gate. 
NN gate is constructed using multiple MOSFETs in series. The output is high only when all the inputs are high. If any input is low, the output is low. This behavior is achieved by connecting multiple MOSFETs in series, where the output of one serves as the input to the next. OR gate. An OR gate is created using multiple MOSFETs in parallel. The output is high if at least one of the inputs is high. The parallel connection allows the current to flow if any of the input signals is at a logic high level. NAND and NOR gates. NAND and NOR gates are combinations of N and NOR gates, respectively, followed by an inverter, not gate. NAND gates produce a high output unless all inputs are high, while NOR gates produce a high output only if all inputs are low. XOR and XNOR gates. XOR, exclusive OR, and XNR, exclusive NOR, gates are constructed using combinations of AND, OR, and NOT gates. XOR produces a high output when the number of high inputs is odd, while XNR produces a high output when the number of high inputs is even. Logic Gate Cascading Digital circuits are constructed by cascading multiple logic gates to perform complex operations. MOSFETs facilitate this cascading by providing the basic switching functionality needed for combining and processing binary information. Signal processing and memory. MOSFETs are also used in more complex digital circuitry such as flip-flops and memory cells, enabling the storage and manipulation of binary information in sequential and memory circuits. The versatility of MOSFETs in digital logic gate design allows for the creation of complex and powerful digital systems ranging from microprocessors and memory devices to application-specific integrated circuits ASICs, used in a variety of electronic devices. The combination of MOSFETs in different configurations enables the implementation of various logical operations, forming the foundation of digital computing. The versatility of MOSFETs in performing these functions contributes significantly to the efficiency, speed, and reliability of electronic devices and circuits across a wide range of applications.